but just in case you never know when uh something crazy is gonna happen all right so we are live yay let me just minimize this and open another one All right, here we go. And Kateri's here. Hi, Kateri. Hey, Kateri. Hey, Kateri, you want to do me a favor and message Sandra and let her know, even though she yeah, saw. Yeah. Hi, Kateri. Hey, Kateri, you want to do me a favor? Oh, hold on. I got to turn my. There we go. <laughs> there we go. That's better. <laughs> We have Carrie Ann. Hi, Carrie Ann and Lisa. Nice. Hello, hello. Glad you're here. Whew. Hi, Carrie Ann. Hi, Amelia. Oh, hey, Amelia. Angie has her food and she oh. is ready. Awesome. She is ready. What you make, Angie? Yeah, Angie, what delicious concoction did you make? Because that was fast, too. That was fast. She probably has a bowl of cereal. <laughs> Thank yeah. you, Kateri. I appreciate it. Well, honey? Yeah. Squeak it. Oh, because you're trying to get him and not her. <laughs> Tessie got each of the dogs a toy, and she's got Otis in her room because... He actually plays. Yes, just starting, Nancy. You didn't miss a thing. I'm still just yakking. He actually plays with his toys, not her. She destroys them. So she's got Otis in her room by himself, so he can play with his toy without Pixie stealing it and destroying it. <laughs> Poor Odie. That's my boy. He's so personal cute. I might have to move the camera a little closer to me. I see that I'm going to have to like reach to get in, get in view. Poor old man is created for, oh, oh, he has a torn ACL. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. Mm. Poor Spencer. I know. I thought it was Kateri for a second. I was like, wait, what? Oh, poor Spencer. But, yeah. He's got a torn ACL. I thought I was going to have to do that to Pixie at one point, but hers was just um, popped out. Then oh. the doctor she popped it back in. So I was happy about that because, man, that is expensive surgery. Is it really? Oh, yeah. Because what she does is she goes in and she, she makes a new groove and Ooh. she puts in a brand new ACL. Ooh. So yeah, it's uh, here in Tupper Lake. It's probably seven hundred to eight hundred dollars. So where you guys live, it's probably double that. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah. 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 Hey, Rosie. Hey, Rosie. How's it going? Oh, you had a niece named Carrie, and cool. Yeah, I like I like those double names. Where you put like they put their middle name with their name. I like those. I think those are neat. So the first thing I thought I would show you guys are these super cute poodle salt and pepper shakers. I don't know if anyone wants them, but they kiss. One of them's missing his magnet. I don't think they've ever been used. I think they were just collected. Somebody had a lot of poodle stuff. And uh, he's missing his magnet, but it'd be easy to replace. And she's got hers. Anybody interested in those? I know it doesn't have anything to do with junk journaling, but they're awful cute. <laughs> they're definitely vintage. Little kissing poodles. Hey, Deb. Hi, Deb. It's going. I'm ready, Erin, Rosie says. Oh, 
curious. It's cute. Uh, Angie used to have poodle hair. Oh, gosh. Angie, you silly goose. Let's see if I can move my chair a little closer. Okay. Okay. So let's get rid of the dogs. <laughs> Just thought I'd offer them in case anybody wanted them. Yes, you have to like poodles. That's right, Kateri. Yes. All right, let me clean up my mess. Okay, so the first thing I thought I would do today, I'm going to auction these off. Because I know more than one person is going to want them, I think. They are um, uh, scripture treasures. Like this one says, salvation. <laughs> Deb is saying hi to Otis. Hmm. Um, it says, but God demonstrates his own love towards us in that while we were still sinners, Christ died for us. And they're two-sided. And it's all, you know, quotes from the Bible and stuff. Salvation, hindrance for prayer. Uh, there's got to be, oh, I'd say a couple hundred of them. Some of them have little pictures. Anything else I should say about them, Maddie? Uh, no, you just tell me if you want a timer, how much you want uh, to start the bidding at. There's love, humility. Oh, there are different colors, too. Trusting in God, yep. They're color-coded, oh, that's depending cool. on the topic. Um, whoops. The church, prayer. Hiya, Deb. Uh, the Bible. Oh, it's like a mauve, a brown, a teal. With a <laughs> mustard color. That's cool. Yeah, blue. Light blue, yeah, yellow. Yellow, all different colors. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, they're pretty. Very pretty. Are you going to do them all as one set? Or are you going to? Nope. Okay. One set. I'm going to auction them off. Start it at a dollar. If you want, Maddie, please. Sure. And do you want and me thank to... you for helping me, Maddie. My pleasure. Do you I want a timer or... timer or no timer? Uh, I don't have a timer. I have a timer. Do you want a timer? Yes, please. Okay. How long do you want on this? Uh, two minutes. Okay, dogs, here it comes. And remember, guys, watch the chat, right? Not so much what we're saying, but the chat. Right. And it comes with a little case. And I don't have my ruler, so I don't know what size they are, but I'm, they're business card size, I would say. So if you liked one particularly and you wanted to tuck it in your wallet or you could give them out to people. Yeah. I don't know what else you would do with them. It'd be great for using as, you know, pockets and just sticking them in pockets and happy mail. and. Oh, that's true. Hey, Sandra. Hello again. Long time no see, right? Hey, Sandra. That was a whole 15 minutes. We had to live without each other. Right? <laughs> Every color of the rainbow in here. Right now, Kateri's got it at two. Yep. Hi, Joey. Hey, Joey. Welcome, welcome. Oh, I wish I had a fan blowing on me right now. It just rained and it's so humid. <laughs> 30, 30 seconds is up. Hey, Cheryl. Cheryl. Glad to see you. Oops. There's a cover of my pen. 
Went to the eye doctor, then driving blind to get to the post office to mail Aaron and Maddie's package. Deb, don't. Oh, my Lord. Don't endanger the world just to get to the post office. And stop. That one sold to Kateri for two. All righty. Congrats, Kateri. These are cool. Thank you, Kateri. Katie, you just missed some, some um, scripture cards. That's all. And hello, Katie. <laughs> Oh, there's Katie. Hi, Katie. I tried to get on Katie's um, sale last night, and I fell asleep. I got there at the end. I didn't even make it to say hello. I was going to say hello and passed out. <laughs> well, I'm glad you did because you were tired. I was so tired. You were a tired girl. All right, those go to Kateri. Those right there. Alrighty. All right. So next we have this really pretty, um, it's a photo book. It's got the brown over here. And then on this side, it's got the picture slots. It's nice brown, like craft paper. I'd say it's got probably 25 pages front and back. And you don't have to use it for pictures. You can put whatever you want in it. And it has this beautiful scene and it's, um, it's like texturized. I don't know quite how to. It's like a canvas, like a pic, like a painting. Oh, cool. Yeah, like they printed it on there. It's canvas. And that's what the back looks like. It's got a little tiny blue mark right there. Oh, no, that's a feather. <laughs> Never mind. Ooh. Now it's floating around. <laughs> um, so we can auction this off starting at a dollar. See if there's any interest in that. It looks like it's about six by six, I would say. And the pictures are, I would say, three by five if you wanted to put one in. And it's it doesn't look like it's ever been used. There's no writing in it or anything. It's pristine. Hi, Cheryl. That is cool. Even to use as an album just like that, it would be so cool because it's like perfect for like a summer theme vacay, like this summer. There you mm -hmm. go. Yeah. Put them put, up there, mount them on like nice, what is it, like a six by six maybe? Yeah. Yeah, that'd be cool. It, uh, yeah, like I said, it's got the nice flat, nice craft paper. Oh, and they're sewn in. I just realized that Katie had asked me for, I think, Rosie's address or something. Oh. <laughs> And I said, as soon as I get home, I'll get it to you. That was yesterday, last night. I'm sorry, Katie, I passed out. That's okay. You didn't feel good. And I did. I just remembered, like, now. <laughs> when I saw her name. Oops. Oh, well, there's Rosie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're coming up on the 32nd. Okay. It's a buck, guys. Even if you just used a pocket. Oh, good, Katie. Yeah. yeah, it would make a, uh, oh, there's a little bit of damage to the inside right there. It looks like somebody, looks like it maybe like got wet and was glued. And when they opened it, it kind of came apart. But the pages are all perforated, which is kind of cool. It is, because if you don't want to use it like that, you can just pull them right out. Yeah, pull them out. They're perforated. On your journals. It's already got the craft paper and the, the little pocket in it. It's all been done for you. Yeah. There we go. Deb's got it at $1.50. Cool, Deb. That is a good deal, just for the pockets themselves, ma'am. Mm -hmm. And the cover is really pretty. Yep. You could definitely turn that into a journal very easily. It, you could, it's, um, it's the kind of spine where if you just took your craft knife and just cut it here and cut it here, it would come right out. And you could turn it into a journal if you wanted very hey, easily. Selena. How are you doing, Selena? Congrats, Deb. And Selena's in the house. Oh, hey, Selena. Hello, hello. Where's Deb? Hello. Hello. Okay. Okay. Um, next, I'm going to sell this pack of note cards. They are from American Greetings. 
They're all there. It's 20 blank notes and 20 envelopes. New in the package. It's a bee. Bee, a butterfly. I have to wait a second. Hi, Aaron. I don't know if there's glare on it or not. Let me just. Oop. Hi, Aaron. It's a bee, a butterfly, and a um, dragonfly. Hey, hey Dana. Dana. Welcome, Dana. All right, I'm going to put it in. It's okay. Up. Yep. And there's two. If the person that wins, they can get, you know, they can have both at that price if they want. That's perfect. You know what I was thinking? You can use the paper. You can use some of them as they are, of course. But hey, Louise. Hi, Louise. Um, welcome, welcome. You can use them as cards, of course. But if you wanted to, they almost look like they could be used for inches, too. Oh, yeah, they could. <laughs> You can fussy cut those and they would even have a frame already. Right. Cuter for embellishments too. Yeah, that's that's what I originally, hey Mike. Hey Mike, <laughs> long time no see. Oh my God, I haven't seen Mike in, wow. Yeah. A month. Right. Good to see you, Mike. Yeah, when I originally saw these, I thought, oh, I could cut those out. <laughs> Now, what's on the inside on the other side? Oh, they're blank. They're blank. Oh, yep. that's cool. Yep. Because then they could be anything. They're from, let's see, is there a year on here? No, nope. no year. But it says it includes the notes sent checklist. Oh, planting season, right? Yeah, you've been a busy boy. Oh, that's true. All right, you got to go a little higher because let me see. Cheryl had it at one already. And oh, Cheryl's got it at one. Yes. Yep. She just happened to bid twice. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The other Aaron is Aaron, the crafty Puerto Rican. Angie. All right, sold to Cheryl. Thanks, Cheryl. You want them both, Cheryl? Dollar a piece? Hey, Fiona. Hey, Fiona. How's it going? Did you finish your breakfast, Fiona? Right. <laughs> Oh, be careful, Abril. Oh, yep. Don't be doing that. Well, I'm sure she's just listening, but yeah. every now and then you get tempted to look over. Don't. No, no, she just typed. Hello, driving. Oh, yeah, she's probably at a stoplight, though. I hope I so. All the time. Or Cheryl, do you want one or both, honey? Oh, so what? Oh, you type it in for me sometimes. I said, don't do that. Mike says, no driving and buying, Abril. <laughs> Yeah, right. <laughs> Both. Okay. Cool. Thank you, Cheryl. Oh, Fiona shared her toast with the dog. Nice. Well, you have to. They sit there and stare at you. I know. They make you feel guilty. They do. And then when you eat the whole thing, they look at you as if to say, oh, you just ate that whole thing. And you, you didn't save me nothing. Exactly. You couldn't save me a piece, really, after all I do for you? So here's a book. It's called 1,000 Beautiful Things. It's a collection of prose and poetry chosen from the world's literature. So it has a gorgeous um, jacket, but the book itself is plain. It's got a little bit of, like, foxing around the edges. Um, it doesn't have any pictures or anything. The pages are yellowed, but it's in good shape. You know, the pages are bendy. So the first me can have that for $1, Maddie. 
okay. That sold to Rosie for a dollar. Thanks, Rosie. All right. Thanks, Rosie. Okay. And I have this really nice um, Webster's Dictionary. Let's see if I can find a year in here. Um, What did I do? Mike wants your can of Mountain Dew. Oh, it's not Mountain Dew. It's seltzer water. Boring. Boring, boring. <laughs> uh, let's see. 1966. Here's the inside. It's got lots of pictures. It's got yellowing around the edges of the page. If you guys, you guys can't really see that very well. Ugh. That's what it looks like. And it looks like it's about six by eight, I would say. Spine is a little cracked, but I'm sure you guys don't care about that. Like I said, lots of pictures. So, um, three dollars to the first me. Okay. Angie's in that book under trouble. <laughs> See, Mike, it's seltzer. How many ladies have English in 1966? <laughs> You're silly. <laughs> That's a lot of ephemera in there, too, which is nice. Yes, tons and tons and tons of pictures and words. There's some... Oh, cool. Those are like fires. Yeah. Is that a, a Harlequin? Oh, oh, Harlequin. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Convict. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. The oh, lion. Birdie. Bird. Oh, butterfly. 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 Mortar and pestle. Another bird. There's always lots of birds. Another bird. Peacock, maybe. Yep. Piano. Piano. No takers on that? No takers. All righty. Oh, wait. A brill oh, one. A brill. Thank you, a brill. A brill. $8. And Cheryl's glad she finally made your sale. Yay, Cheryl. All right. This next book is called Wedding Flowers. That's the dust jacket. Here's the cover. It's kind of a greenish black. Original price at the bookstore was $25. It's from, let's see. Is from if I can find it. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, 1991. Oh, look at that picture. I'll go through a couple pages, and the first me can have it for three after I show it for a little bit. Rosie? Look at that. Look at those pages. Oh, look at those each individual. Aaron said, Rosie said, Aaron, would you please read a poem? Oh, you want me to read a poem out of your book? Sure. Aaron, 
Abril says, yay for a stoplight, right? They can be your friends. Abril, did you buy that driving? <laughs> no, she would not. Let's see if I can find a short one, Rosie. There is a tide by William Shakespeare. There is a tide in the affairs of men, which taken at the flood leads on to fortune. Omitted, all the voyage of their life is bound in shallows and in miseries. On such a full sea are we now afloat, and we must take the current when it serves or lose our ventures. From Julius Caesar. Ooh. And there's all, there's Charles Lamb. The greatest pleasure I know is to do a good action by stealth and to have it found out by accident. Aw, that's awesome. Yeah. Okay. Um, so two dollars on this, Maddie. Starting or no, first? no. First me can have it, two bucks. All right. Wedding book. Wedding flowers. Two dollars. That one sold to Katie. Katie. Okay. Thank you, Katie. Congrats, Katie. And thank you. Oh, that's a pretty page right there. You left it on yeah. your page. And it's loaded with, with images like that, the whole book. Really pretty. Just the oh. whole. Oh, goodbye, Katie. Wow. Just full. It's got a lot of little kids in it, too, which is cute. Oh, Kateri says, I needed a poem, a poem book, too. Sad face. I'll be looking out for one for you, Kateri. Okay, so next I have what I call these... Um, I call these like bright or sparkly uh, fabric bundles. I have one, two, three, four. I have four available and they're all pretty much the same. So you get this black lace with silver flowers. Oh, pretty. You get a piece of that. And then you get a piece of this. Um, and then they're all different shapes and sizes. This is paisley. If you can see that or not, there you go. Now we can see it. Yeah, there's some paisley, and then you get some sequin. Oops, some sequin material. It's gold. That's gold. And you get a piece of this, which is beading. Oh, that's pretty. And you get a piece of this really pretty rose with uh, silver thread. Piece of that. And then you get a piece of this. It's like a, it's almost like a marigold color with gold. There's that one. And then you get a piece of this this is pink with i think it's silver it's hard to tell in this light okay so those are two dollars and there's one two three four so if anyone wants one the first four me's can have one two bucks four available right yep One goes to Katie. Another, okay, thank you, Katie. Another one to Abril. I've got two more. I have two two yep. You get all the sparkly goodness. Good and for I, a boho journal, that's for sure. Well, I like it because it's got like you know, the tones are like the reds and the pinks and the blacks and the, yeah, they're really nice deep colors. Yes, the bill says gorgeousness. All I right. Know. So there's still two of those available if anybody wants one. 
just fold these up. <laughs> Angie. Angie. <laughs> Don't be hating. Right. <laughs> and you need a brew. Yes, gypsy journal, I agree. Oh, Fiona says they're beautiful. Shame I have no money at all right now. I feel you, Fiona. That's okay. Just hang out with us. We like the company. Hello. Okay. Now I have this super cute book. It's called the Read It Yourself Storybook. It it's a golden book. The only writing that I saw when I looked at it was this on the inside. The little kid like connected all the characters. That's really cute, and it's from, let's see, 19, it was first published in 1960, and this edition was uh, printed in 1971. Hey, Allie. Oh, Allie's here. Cool. Hey, Allie. So this is Read It Yourself. Can you read it yourself? Oh, PTA says, I love the moo cow on the front. Yeah, and it's got a lot of pages. It's got, well, I could tell you how many pages it's ha it has, actually. <laughs> That's the inside back cover. It has 214 pages. Cute graphics. Yeah, it's, it's a super cute book. Oh, look at the hippo driving a car. So this is $3 to the first me. If anyone wants it, there's the doggies. Look at the cow peeking over the fence. Oh, the doggy. He's so cute. Oh my gosh. He's got a tree for a hair. <laughs> Says, I'll wear this um, at, till my own hair grows back. And he did. That is sold to Patricia Cook. Hi, Patricia, by the way. Patricia, thank you. Yes, and welcome, welcome. Glad you're here. Oh, Deb wanted to know if it had giraffes. Oh, I don't think so, Deb. We'll just go with that so you don't feel bad. I know, right? <laughs> I'll just say no, of course not. Yeah, no giraffes. No, not a one. <laughs> and I'm going to auction this stationary set off, but let me show you what it looks like first. This is the the envelope it comes in, you know, that's its original envelope. And then it comes with these really pretty, like pink, like the crayon color pink, like it, they're just pink. And then there are these beautiful cards. They come, it's a trifold. Oh, cool. And then this is what the back looks like. So you fold this in, it's got a little scene and then they all have a fence or something to look through. Oh. And it only has one little saying that would be so easy to cover up if you wanted to. Patricia says, Aaron, I said yes to your email. Okay, awesome, Patricia, thank you. Okay. And then there's this one. That one's a happy birthday one. And then there's what that scene looks like. Ah, with the bench. Yep. These are so and, and there's this one. And these, these colors are very vibrant. They're not dull at all. And then there's the, uh, what you look through. Aww. With the geraniums and. Um, the trellis, yeah. What are those called, morning glories? And let's see. I think there's 
that. Let me see. I think there's two or three of each. Let me just. So there's two of that one. And there's another hat. That one. Oh, here's another different one. Nope. I, I, is it? Yeah, it is. So there's four different ones. I looked at a purple. And then there's the, uh, this one has a little fence. Oh. That one's really cute. That one. And there's another one of these. And oh, brilliant. She says, I'm inside now. She's home finally. She says, bring it, Erin. All right, girl. This is a bench that goes there. Could have done this earlier, right? <laughs> I'm loving these. It's uh, another fence. Rosie says, I want that. <laughs> all right, so it looks like they're all here. There's three of each. Four different designs, right? So what I'm going to do is... I will sell one of each for a dollar to three people. And you'll get three envelopes. Does that sound fair? So you're basically paying a quarter a card. Okay. So you want me to just put cart and envelope set a dollar? Yep. Okay. And the first piece? The first four or three i have three three yep okay here we go you'll get one of each for a buck sold let's see to katiri maddie sorry i had to jump in there all right and katie okay all right. Thank you. Thanks, ladies. I almost didn't let them go, you know. <laughs> no, those are really pretty. Um, let's auction off this treasure box. Let me see if I can get this down a little bit closer. I just feel like I'm too far away. So let me wait for the for it to catch up. There we go. Okay. So it's tied with tool and it's a vintage Whitman's and it's in, you know, it's embossed. All the flowers are raised. These are purple violets. And it goes all around the edge. It's not that vintage, though. It's got a UPC. All around the edge. So that's what the box looks like. And it's got hinges. And this is, like, puffed out. And this is blue. This is a blue-themed box. So here's a paper ruffle made with um, dyed paper that I made with, like, a... Uh, Oh, what is that brown rough fabric called? Mm. It's not burlap. It's like it's cotton, but it's not dyed. Canvas? No, not canvas. Unbleached muslin, maybe. Okay. Um, here's some computer labels, some diskette labels. It's oh, my in frame. Rosie yeah. has a question. I'm sorry. Rosie says, Aaron, please send poem book to Kateri and bill me. Oh, okay. You're so sweet. All right. And they said canvas, muslin, and muslin. So, okay. Yeah. Right. Send muslin to Kateri. All right. Rosie's so sweet. Here's a little. Actually, this is like a blue, like aqua, I guess. Like, there's a uh, a little tassel Aww. with a lobster claw clasp. A blue flower with, it's got clips 
and it had a pin on there, but it came off. It's the pin. Let me see. Yeah, I think. Oh no, the pin's on there. It's got a clip, a pin, and a hair tie. So there's three options, but it's so pretty. There's that. And then I put this, um, this is wallpaper. It's got a hummingbird. Am I in frame? Yeah, I'm in frame, okay. Cheryl says okay, Cheryl. Yeah, okay, bye. Oh, Cheryl. you're having a sale tonight. Oh, Cheryl. What time, Cheryl? So there's that. Oh, they're arguing. <laughs> Let them argue. Feel I fine. know I am. And then here is some, this is sari fabric. It's a pretty good, pretty nice sized piece. It's about, oh, 30 inches by six inches. 6P Central Standard, sure I said. Okay. All right, I'll be late then. <laughs> All right. So there's that. And then I made some rosettes. These are just plain. You can do what you want. There's three of those. And then I put in some gold doilies. This sucker is packed, by the way. It looks it. Wow. Some gold doilies. There's like six or eight of those. You know how they stick together? A bag of beads. There's turtles and clear glass and wood, all blues, turquoise, um, this piece of trim. That's definitely vintage. That's blue and green with the fringe. You can leave it like that or you can cut it. Um, some blue paper clips, some stripy ones, some metallic ones. And some plain ones. Let me let me pull those out so you can see. Those metallic stripes, blues, and greens. Just put those back in there. Um, a whole roll of this. Oh, what color would you call that? It's like a dark turquoise. Yeah, an aquamarine. Yeah, that's a whole roll of that. I know it's never been used. The original piece of tape is still on there. Um, two rolls of washi tape. This is glitter, blue glitter. And then this is, mm, it's like a turquoise and it has little gold dots inside the flowers. Uh, let's see. Some I used Katie's bag. I reused your bag, Katie. <laughs> this bag of bling and embellishments. That's exactly what we want to see. Plastic being recycled. Yes. For yep. you. All sorts of hearts, flowers, fish, bows, bling. Um, what else is in here? Cute little bows. Some just... So that's pretty full, that bag. I won't make you suffer through me putting it back till after. <laughs> I'll just make a little pile. I'll get it all back in there, I promise. Oh, let's see. Some Monopoly money. Blues and greens. Some sorry cards. This really pretty, um, yeah. Water lily, blue playing card, some geese, a flower, another flower, and some watches. And they're all in the same color family. And these are all different colored pom-poms, blue and green, blue and green and navy blue, I think. Some blue thread, really pretty thread. I love that color. Um, these are postcards from Capri, and they're all Mediterranean, you know. Mm -hmm. I, think, I think Capri is in the Mediterranean. I don't know. But anyway, there's those. 
some blue embroidery floss, but it's a different kind. It's like twisted. It's called Broider Fast Royal Society Boiling Dye. There's that piece of this really pretty ribbon, some pom pom trim, which I love to use. I love that stuff. Turquoise trim. I think Terry gave that to me. I think. Um, I kept some for myself. These really cute hole reinforcers, they're donuts. I think they're adorable. <laughs> um, some tags I made from vintage cards. They're on file folder. Oh, that one's not backed. So you get a pile of those, and there's one that I made. Some guest checks. Quite a few of those. Uh, like six, I think. Some of these um, recipe cards. Really cute gardening kind of ones. Let me know if I'm out of frame, you guys. <laughs> a carabiner. You can use this to hang your charm that I gave you from your journal. Some blue buttons on a card. It says Japan on them. A couple blue napkins. Some hand printed um, paper with the strips. That's a lot of stuff. Yeah, I packed this sucker. There's some birds, some swallows, and the paper strips. Some more napkins. Some blue wallpaper. That is, you know, it's probably 24 inches long. Some green tickets. Um, some little embellishments. They're kind of sparkly. That one has a swallow on it. What's this? Oh, some tickets that I stamped. This is Ticket to Happiness. There's a bunch of those. And then the rest is fabric, I think. All different fabric. You get this one, this one, then they're all folded. Hi, Roy. Hey, Roy. That one, three, four, five. This piece of really pretty trim that I put on almost everything. <laughs> Some dotted Swiss and that color turquoise and brown or blue so there is that and we'll auction that off might as well start it at a dollar maddie okay dokes while you're auctioning it off i will pack everything back inside here it goes two minutes on the clock and like i said everything is folded all the uh the fabric is folded so you're getting you know you're getting a good amount and I ironed all this fabric to make it really like flat so I could fit it in here. Hey, Debbie's got it at five. Cool, Deb. Thanks. Katie's got it at seven. Nice. Thanks, Katie. So many things out of that journals, tags, pockets, ephemera, oh, embellishments. I mean, yeah. And it could be, I was, when I was looking at it, I was thinking, hmm. It could be something like uh, like the winter theme, but it could also be mermaid. I mean, it could be so many things. Debbie's yeah. at nine. Thanks, Deb. At ten. Yeah, I packed her full. <laughs> that is a beautiful collection. Thanks. Yeah, it's loaded, right, Abril? <laughs> oh, and you get the tin, too. I forgot. Yes. Yeah, she get the gorgeous tin. Debbie's got it at 13. Nancy came in at 11. I got to bump it up some more. Thanks, Deb and Nancy. And for those of you watching the clock, 30 seconds. 
The only thing I didn't have to put in here because I didn't own any at the time were buttons. I didn't have any blue or green buttons to put in here. But other than that, you pretty much had pretty much have everything. The ribbon, the thread, the washi tape, the, you know, cards, wallpaper, trims, beads, doilies, flowers. <laughs> yeah, ready made tassel too. Yeah, the tassel, paper clip, the colored paper clips to go with. You can get sorry fabric. That sold to Debbie for 13. Thank you. Nice. Congrats, Debbie. You got a good deal, girl. Yes, indeed. <laughs> Let me pack it back up. I'll have to put it in, you know, nicely so it all fits. Yoda says you had a button card. Yes, she did. Oh, yes, there were buttons in there. Okay, then you got everything. <laughs> you got it all. You even got paper. Paper fabric, buttons, embellishments, beads, everything. All right. Congratulations, Debbie Long. Right? That's who won it? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me just write that down. Allie was saying you got everything in there but candy. <laughs> everything with candy. I can put candy in there. I have some right here. <laughs> Debbie Long. How did you fit it to begin with in the first place? I know, right? Treasure. Just crammed it in there. You're right. I just kept going until I couldn't fit any more in there. <laughs> um, all right, so I have some Reader's Digest books. They're a dollar. And we're just going to do ABC. These are very similar. And if you want me to gut them and just send you the, the cover, I'm more than willing to do that. Madison, um, she's here, yeah, but oh, Debbie Long said no candy, diabetic. Okay, <laughs> oh, girl says, okay, send it to me. You're funny, guys. She'll take the candy. A brill, yeah, I guess so. A, B. A and B are very similar, just the background on A is a little darker than the background on B. And their the colors are a little more muted, like the orange is a little more rusty, a little bit. They're very, very similar. That's what, oh, geez. That's what the spines look like. They're embossed spines. And it doesn't feel like they were ever opened. They're still really tight. This one has the ad in it still. A does. Um, so yeah, dollar, if anyone wants one of those, A, B, or C. Okay. Allie Madison says hi. Hi, Allie. She said hi. And if you want me to gut it, just say so, and I will do that for you. Katie. Katie what wants all three. Okay. Oh. Katie. 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 I have more, you guys. Thank you, Katie. Ooh. All right. So I have this one. This has got like a faint yellow starburst, and then it has like green, and the background is like a light bluish turquoise. And the spines are the spine is embossed on that one too. Um, there's another one of those. And then there's this one. And the spines are embossed on all three of those. Hi, Margie. Hey, Margie. How's it going? World treating you right today. Allie says, I would use, like, books because of the um, decorations on the spines. Yes, they're so pretty. Oh, yeah, the spines are really nice. I agree. 
Hello, Maria. Hi, Maria. Hi, Maria. All right, if you want to put those in for a dollar, Maddie. Ready. Oh, <laughs> Katie wants them all. I think Katie likes the spines. <laughs> and Kateri was right underneath of her. And then she went before the go. Come on, Kateri. <laughs> Kateri is just popping in. <gasps> awesome. So I think that is the last of the embossed spines. Let me see. Katie says she's in love with them. Uh, yeah. Okay. So that's the last. This is the last of the embossed spines. So the first me can have it for a dollar. Okay. Wait for the go, guys. Watch the chat. Okay. Yay. There you go. Do you see Kateri? Oh, yeah, I did. Okay. Got one, Kateri. <laughs> All right, now I have these, which are a little more beat up. This one's a little beat up. It's got what's inside this one. It's like a piece of paper. Oh, this is part of the jacket, the dust jacket. This one's got a nice, um, oh gosh. Inside one has pretty trees. Right, let me see if the tape will come off without ruining the cover. The tape pulls the spine apart, but it doesn't pull the actual cover color off let me just make sure come on come off we use good tape yeah it doesn't uh like i said it pulls the spine apart but it doesn't hurt the actual cover of the book i just peeled that one see it doesn't hurt the book so this one is like gray and cream marbled with dark gray stripes. Um, these are also a dollar. This one has pretty trees. And then this one is that. Oh, those are so pretty. Oh, Katie. Hold it, Katie. OK. Oh, sorry, Amelia. And uh, Roy's got a question. He wants okay. to, he says, best way to remove the corners from a Marvel combo book, books. Oh, the composition books. I heard combo, compo. Oh. Find bigger and keep an integrity signature. I think I'm going to make a reusable cloth cover. Okay. I'll let folks in chat handle that one. Right. Sorry, ladies. A grill. Too late. And there's this one. This is like flame, flame stitch. Um, this is red and blue. This one is not as thick. But it's also the flame stitch. So A, B, and C. If anyone wants one, they're a dollar. Maria says they're gorgeous covers. And poor um, Abril's tried twice. So the first time it was pooey. This one's a double pooey. <laughs> They're in if you want one. Well, oh, they don't like these, I guess. What? Those are cool covers. Katie will take one. Which one, Katie? Or all? Take care, Fiona. Thanks for hanging out with us. Bye, Fiona. You want them all gutted? Or just these three gutted? 
Just these, okay. Bye, Luz. Luz Mercado is here. Hey, Luz. Welcome, welcome. Okay, here's this one. This one, the, the spine on these are on um, are fine. This is like a grayish background with green stripes and then a dark brown, very fine stripe in between. The spine is also good on this one. This is brown and like a dark brown. This one is a little bit loose. Um, this one is orange and cream. Those are a dollar. And they're up. Abril will take, which one, Abril? A. A, okay. And then pink rose. Which one, hun? That's Nadine, right? Yep. You want a different one other than A, Rose? Allie, Aaron, where did you find all these ink readers that I just put the pattern covers? Oh, no. Nope, Nadine says she wanted A. Okay. Okay, so we still have B and C available. I really like B and C. You know why? Because they also tend to be a little bit more masculine, aside from uh, vintage. Yes. And, and you know, again, like those cards we were talking about, those sweaters that you were, you know, loving for the Father's Day envelopes that I did, that's what they remind me of, like that, that vintage gentleman, you know, sweater type of yeah thing. be great yeah they do i totally agree a guy's journal would be killer bye angie bye angie Girl's leaving too all right amelia enjoy dinner enjoy enjoy okay i have three left wait 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 b is so oh. sweet oh. to take me okay okay Thank you. Rose. Yes, thank you very much. And nobody wanted C? Not that I can so far. Right. Okay, so C is still available. So this one is kind of covers a little bit loose. This is cream with brown and like a darker tan. That's what that one is. I love this one. This one's my favorite. This one is green and red. Like, it's not really red, red. It's more like a brownish red. Mm -hmm. I think that one's really pretty. And then this one is super cool. This one's missing the spine cover, but it's really pretty. So wow. there's those three. These are the last three. It does look like Rick Rack. You're right, Rosie. Huh? <laughs> at the previous C look like Rick Rack. Oh yeah. So Katie would like A. Okay. And then Kateri would like B. Okay. And you gotta be kidding me that nobody wants C. That's the cutest one. Oh my gosh. With a teal color. Come on. Oh, and Katie will take C also. Okay. I was going to say, what? I know. It's the cutest one. <laughs> Thank you, ladies. Yeah. Oh, and Terry would like for you to please gut it. Okay. Oh, and Katie as well. Okay. It does, right, Allie? Yes. It looks like something out of Little Women. Oh, yes. Cute. Totally. All right. 
Wow, they all went but one. Thank you, ladies. And I still can't believe that one didn't go. Yeah. Okay, so I have these really cute polka dot. Hi, Linda. Hey, Linda. These are all polka dot. I went through my material and I picked out all the polka dot I could find and I made these packs. There's three available. I'll go through. They're tied with this polka dot sash. And then there's, I love this one, the yellow and the blue. So pretty. And these are, these are folded. No, it's, it's a decent sized piece of fabric. Oh yeah. There's plenty for a journal there. If you I want tried to be, yeah, I tried to be generous. And then this one is like ombre. Oh, it changes. Oh, cool. And then there's a little piece of this. Cause that's all I had. And then there's a little piece of that, which coordinates with it. A piece of this. And then a piece of this. This is fabric with ribbons sewn to it. Oh, cool. And then you get a big piece of what the sash was made out of. That has a cool stripe at the top. And then you get a pretty good sized piece of this. I don't know if you can see, but it's it's like green with blue. Uh, hello, B Moz. I'm not sure who is um, her name. B Moz Crafty Corner. Hey, Bima. Bima, is that how? Yeah. It's oh, hi, Bima. And then you get this really. I, I'm. I kept a piece of this for myself for my strawberry journal. It's white with the red. Oh. And then you get white with the black. And you get a piece of turquoise, or I'm sorry, corduroy. This is like a dark gray with pink. So those are $3, and there are three of those available. Okie dokes here. Anybody go. wants them. I see spots. I see spots, right? Lots and lots of pretty spots. Nancy will take one. Thank you, Nancy. <laughs> will take one. She needs a medic. You don't need a medic. We already oh. talked about this. We're just going to own it. It's okay. Why? Why just, you know, why fight it? Oh. Close your eyes. Close your eyes, Sandra. <laughs> All right, so there's still one of those available if someone wants one. While I fold these up, put it back into its pretty little package. So there's one more. Yep. While she's putting that away, I'll wait for another me. You get all those awesome pieces of fabric. You missed my me, Maddie, for Orphan what? I didn't miss it. Oh, you want the orphan? What orphan? Oh, for the book? Oh, okay. Orphan C. Oh, yes, Reader's Digest. Oh. I didn't miss it, Abril. I'm sorry. Awesome. They all sold then. Yay. Yay, yay, yay. All right. Got it or not, Abril? <laughs> Roy. <laughs> oh, my gosh, Roy. None of hers were gutted. She didn't request, so. She said, yes, please. Oh, gutted? Okay. You want all of them gutted, Abril? LMAO not. Okay. Now I'm confused. Yeah, you have to put in, you know I'm, what? We can, you, we can talk later. Yeah, that's true. We'll talk later. <laughs> Silly no, got it. There you go. That answered the question. All right, good. One more of the fabrics. Look at all that yumminess she's put in so far. She's folding and folding and still folding. Yep. For three dollars. Okay. 
All righty. Okay. Don't forget your thumbs up, guys. There's uh, 39 of you watching, and I think I see 14 thumbs up. So we can do better than that. Oh, yes, please. Get, those, get them up. Get them up, thumbs. <laughs> All right. So I have one of these. Hi, Maria. Hey, Maria. Oh, bye, Maria. Yep. <laughs> I want guts, just not my belly gut. Yeah, I yep. feel you. Maria's got her thumbs up. So this comes with a napkin with rickrack sewn around the edge. This is all floral. This is a floral pack. Okay. Come with a really good size of, that's uh, lavender flowers. And then here's blue and pink. Oh, that one's pretty. And this one is pink on pink with little blue, tiny blue. I think those are blue circles. It's hard to tell. And then here's another, there's some purple roses. And I think this is reproduction feed sack. I think this one is reproduction feed sack. And I think that one is, Ooh. I think. Oh, that's a good way to describe it. Allie says, this is a little house on the prairie bundle. Yeah. Oh, how funny, Allie. Pretty. Piece of this orange. This is like an orangish red or a reddish orange with orange flowers. And I'm 99% sure this is reproduction feed sack. This is like so feed sack looking to me. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. um, Flower, get your thumbs ready. Yep, I think that one is too. Look at that. That's a lot of flowers. Gorgeous. This is, this is from a curtain. I cut that apart. And then this is pink and red roses. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Okay. So you get one. How much are you? Uh, 350. One, two, three. You get like 10, at least 10 pieces. And how many do you have? I have one. Oh, that's going to go fast. There it goes, Kateri. Okay. Sorry, ladies. Let's see. I knew that one was going to go. Hey, cat. Oh, cat's here. Cool. Hi, cat. All right. I'm just going to do this instead of folding those all separately. Darla. I'll fold them all pretty later, I promise. Hey, Darla. Darla says, no, you started a store without me? <laughs> I did, Darla. I did. I know, right? How could she? Terrible. Can't take her anywhere. <laughs> okay. All right. So here is another floral pack. It's different, though. This one is tied with um, butterfly fabric. It's got, can you guys see that? That it has butterflies? Yes. Okay. All right, and then you get the purple. That pink and blue. The pink on pink. Purple. This one's also 350. Get ready, ladies. Orange feed sack. Blue on blue. Blue. The rose. And in this one, you get a piece of this instead of, I don't know. I, I don't know which one I swapped it out for, but. And then it's tied with the butterfly fabric. Remember to keep watching the chat, guys, because that's always going to be the most accurate. That one sold to Darla. Okay. Cat, she's 
butterflies. That is made for me, right, Erin? <laughs> So close, cat. Okay. Woo, I am sweating, ladies. <laughs> How warm is it up there? I don't know, but it, it rained and it's so humid. Yeah. All right, so now I have these curtain panels. Uh a girl says Angel came in and hugged her and distracted her. She missed it. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> and Kat says she tried. So these, these are big pieces of fabric. They're beautiful. Ooh. Beautiful, beautiful. They're lined. You could use them for um, like pretty large balances. They're showing red on YouTube, but they're not. They're a little bit red, but it's, it's a nice pink. So I have one, and they're big. They're like um, half a yard each. I have one, two, three of those, and um, $2 a piece on those. The first three me's can have it. Uh, bits, do you have some shoes, men's shoes? <laughs> Hmm. No. Okay. No. Oh, everyone does that, Roy. So those are two a piece. If anyone wants one, and you get a lot of fabric. Okay, I'm sorry. I was. Paying. And it's beautiful. All right. How much? Two. Two a piece. Two dollars and how many? Oh, there's three available. Okay. And there's a lot of fabric there. Here we go. <laughs> Sold to Katie, Linda, and Kateri. Thank you, ladies. Which? Thank you, thank you. Oh, hi, country girl scrapping. Is it Lynn? Oh boy. She put in parentheses Lynn, so I think her name is Lynn, I'm guessing. I'm gonna write it down so I don't forget. <laughs> Unless you're not Lynn, in which case you wanna correct me. So I don't <laughs> yes, I'm sorry. Entry. All right, I have this necklace I thought someone could use for a really pretty charm on a journal. It's got the turquoise ribbon. And then it's got all of these dangles. Well, hello, Lynn. It is Lynn. Hey, good job, Maddie. So that necklace is two to the first me. Someone okay. like it? Here it is. And this is what it looks like when it's all dangled down. And that is Here. Rosie. All right. Thanks, Rosie. Uh, no, I don't have any men's watches. No shoes, no watches. No, sorry. Thanks, Rosie. And I'll try to find a cute little bag or something to put that in. All right, let's do another treasure box. How's that sound? Had cataract surgery on the 17th. Still woozy. They had to give me extra drugs. Oh, geez. Oh. I'm very, very sorry to hear that. Hope you're feeling better now. Yes. I hope you uh, you overcome that. So this is tied with a scarf. It's um paisley. Long. It's like a foot. It's like a yard long paisley scarf. And then it's got a pink poodle on the top. Oh. With a flower and a butterfly. And this is what the box looks like. It's got angels. And then this is a pink themed box. 
These are made, these tags are made from vintage cards. This has got the glitter on it. It's backed on um, file folder. Is it just my screen or are you too high? Oh, yep, yeah, I am. Okay. Yep. Shoot. So here's the box. Sorry, guys. Let me move that can out of the way. All right. And you guys, did they see the poodle? Yes? Yes. Okay. We can definitely see it now. All right. So there's the tag. The sparkles came on this. Those are vintage sparkles. <laughs> All right. Here's another tag. And then just little pieces of green and pink dyed paper that I dyed myself. And then this little matchbook. This is fabric. And then it's got the dyed paper on the inside. It's sewn around the edges. And this little book, it's closed with a pink button sewn with green thread. It's a little trifold. And these vintage clip on earrings to use on whatever you want. And then another trifold with the button, the button closure. You just fold it back and put it there like that. Cute. And there's this one. This has a little dangle sewn right on. It's just three beads. They're faceted. The cluster sewn on with a button. And that folds down. And then it's got a little pink gingham in there. Where's that? A napkin. A couple napkins. Flowers on one side and a bee on the other. Oh, we have them. So cute. <laughs> Two of those, um, a roll of washi tape. It's peach with gold on it. And then these little um, brushes that you can get in the hospital, but I thought that the top of it is shaped like a flower, and I thought you could use it as a paintbrush. As a stamper, yeah. A stamper. Yeah. Um, some of this pink. Hi, Vicky. Oh, hi, Vicki. How are you? And I thought that would be cool on the spine or whatever you want, but some of those. We'll be here. Yeah. I added some really cute stamps. This is a rag doll with sitting next to a watermelon. It's by Sherry. I don't know if you guys are familiar with that or not, but and it's used. And then here's the other stamp that goes with it. Here, Madison. So you get two stamps, you get a roll. This is fastened with a little tiny clothespin. And this is pink printed ribbon. It's got like, um, like a Victorian lace print on it. There's quite a bit of that on there, at least a yard. And that's fastened with a little clothespin. And then you get a piece of this really pretty uh, Art Deco fabric. Hi, Brandon. Oh, Brandon, hi. And then you get a really pretty, I didn't iron this, I should have, but I did not. Um, hanky. It's got all along it, and then it's got the corner. Oh, that's so cute. And you also get this hanky. It's pink and green. And it's all around the edge. It's got that really pretty edging. And then you get this hanky, which has pink, pink roses. And you get a piece of this. Has the crochet crocheted edging. You get about a foot of that. It's corner to corner, so you have a couple corners there to work with if you want. You get the these pink and green. This is applique. 
you get one, two, three, four pieces of that. And of course, you get a little tassel. Um, some ribbon with the pink. Aww. Some of this really pretty pink trim. I love this stuff. Uh, some rolled up strawberry ribbon held with a little clothespin. Some flowers. Four roses. This little pink ribbon, which coordinates with the, there's two of those. They coordinate with the poodle. Here's an embellishment I made. And then these are just plain pink ones. You get three or four, three, one, two, three of those. Some book plates from the library of, you get one, two, three of those. A pink kitty cat strawberry shortcake card. Oh. <laughs> Some more. This is silky ribbon. And it's rolled with um, the big Rick Rack. It's rolled right in there. So you get that. And some pink fabric. And this is the only, and some pink paper with polka dots. So there's that. We could start the bidding at a dollar. Two minutes and see where it goes. Yes, Sandra, my daughter is cutting vegetables. Sorry. She said sorry. I don't think they mind. <laughs> oh, wait. Madison just took. Hang on a second, guys. Okay. Madison, yeah. And I just realized she took my timer. Oh. <laughs> Let me see if I can. Hang on. Oh. Sure, you could subscribe. You betcha. Yeah, Brandon, do you like to do crafts? Okay, ready. Okay. Madison, you little timer thief. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she says. <laughs> Darla's got it at one. Cool. Strawberry shortcake, yeah. Got a lover. Nancy's at two, Patricia's at three. Thanks, guys. Glad you like it. Carla's at four. The hankies alone are worth that. I know people go crazy over those hankies. Oh, yeah. <laughs> A brill singing. Oh, a brill is singing. Cool. Strap a bop up a berry. Extraordinary. Aaron, what is that beige ceramic looking thing next to your keyboard? I am dying to know. Oh, the poodles. Oh, the poodles. They're salt and pepper shakers. They're for sale. <laughs> we wanted them earlier. <laughs> Bye, Vicky's at six. Oh, I'll throw them in with this. Whoever wins this can have them. They kind of go together. Oh, that's so cute. Yes, because of the poodle. The poodle. Yeah, they're kissing. They're little kissing poodles. Poodle uh, salt and pepper shakers. Mickey's at seven. Kathy. Hey, Kathy. Kathy's at eight. Hi, Kathy. Nancy's at 10. Kathy's at 11. You got to go higher, Kiria. Nancy's at 12. And stop. I have Kate, Kathy at 14. Okay, cool. Thank you so much, Kathy. Oh, sorry, Darla. Vicky, you're out of the of the bidding or you're out as in going? Oh, Kathy says send it to Darla. <gasps> Kathy, you're so sweet. Kathy, you're so sweet. Send to Darla. Aw. 
She'll think of you every time she uses her salt and pepper shakers. <laughs> Okay, so now I have this. You can tell this was very well used. This is a menu making book for professionals in quantity cookery. Whoever had this book used it. It says clute on the inside. Yeah. It is from 1945. Chefs and Stewards Handbook for Quantity, Menu Making, The Efficient Waitress, Tea Room Profits, The Efficient Bellman, Hotel Data Book, uh, Kitchen Management, Breakfast Profits, Coffee Preparation and Service. So there's some pretty, pretty funny stuff in here. And that's what the inside looks like. Top priced terrace dining room plate luncheon. Luncheon menu making. They went down a little bit. Oh, and then it's got charts. There's a a menu. Sample menus. What are you doing? Banquet menus. So if anyone wants that, they can have that for a dollar. Sounds like cooking for your family, right? <laughs> and that's going to go to Pink Rose. Okay. Thank you, Rose. Right. When I have the complete medical guide, there's what the spine looks like. What does it say? What does it say? Check it out. Check it out. And this is from. Let's see. Mm -hmm. 19, originally 1956, and this one's from nine, oh, 1971. Chester Jones, MD, You and Your Body. So it's got cool pictures in it. Oh, that's cool. Yep. Oh, those are neat. Mm hmm And this one I'll auction. Started at a dollar. All sorts of neat pictures in it. Let's see. Some more of those. Oh, is that a big pocket in there? Oh yeah. It's like a jump. Oh, you know what it is? It's when they do the revised edition, sometimes they'll send you pages. Oh yeah. Oh wait a minute. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What is this? Oh, it's a chart. Oh, it's a chart. <gasps> That's so cool. It's a little book. It's a pocket of charts. There are how many? And they're they're two sided. Yeah, it's a book. Uh, there's one, two, journal packs and journal four. pages. Yeah, that's cool. Family medical record book, and it goes in this pocket. Pocket's kind of coming apart, but you can re glue it if you want. I love this. A giant library pocket. Those are expensive. I just bought some. They're very expensive. And there's uh, a, uh, <laughs> an envelope from the DMV, from New York, uh, 1984, March 7th, 1984. <laughs> Never neglect a skin disease. Well, <laughs> Of your food dollars. Yeah. Right now, Debbie's got it at six. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Those are really neat. The organs of digestion, skeletal muscles. Mm 
exercises. Birth. And stop. Okay. That is sold to Debbie for six. Debbie Long? Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, Debbie Long. Oops, I misspelled Debbie. Sorry, Debbie. Why, not IE. Right. Correct. Okay, let's drag this pile over. What do we got here? Oh, this book is cool. It's a vintage handwriting analysis. The Art and Science of Reading Character by Grapho. You said what I get. Grapho Analysis by N.N. Bunker. M.N. Bunker. I think this book is so neat. And it has, wait till you see the pages in here. It is from 1959. And this will be an auction also. Okay. The pages in here are so cool. It's all full of different, look, all different handwriting. The book is loaded. There's Thomas Edison's signature, and then he analyzes it. This is Oppenheimer, I think. Yep, Philip Oppenheim was a slow, careful thinking writer. His handwriting shows it. Native all different. Uh, one, Amelia's got it at two. All different famous people. And he analyzes, but it's got all different writing in it. All different samples. That's cool. Yeah, isn't it neat? You could use these. For, there's Betty Davis. Then he analyzes her, uh, her handwriting. Uh, Norma Shearer. This is a rabbi, Rabbi Stephen Wise. People used to have such beautiful handwriting. Yeah. All right, bye. I forgot. I'm sorry, I forgot his name. Oh, he just told us, and I forgot already. Yeah, me too. <laughs> sorry. Bill Tilden, Ella Wheeler, Rosie's got it. Not Rosie Rose. Uh, Nadine's got it at two fifty. Cool. This is such a neat book, you guys. Then the person underlined and made notes, which I think is neat. Look at this. Look at this. Color coded notes. Brandon, thank you. Yes, Rosie. That's Dwight Eisenhower, Harry Truman, uh, Clinton Fisk, Carlton Fisk, James Garfield, Teddy Roosevelt. 275. William Howard. Oh, who's this? And stop. It sold to Emilia for 75. Thank you, Amelia. What did I just say? Emily. Oh, my Lord. <laughs> First, I misspelled Debbie. Okay, yeah. Maddie needs to go get coffee or something. <laughs> I can't read anymore, guys. What year is it? It's 1950. What did I say? 1954? I don't remember. 1959. I don't even remember Brandon's name from like two minutes. Brandon. <laughs> right. Oh. Um, who wants to do fabric uh, swatch books? Anybody? Oh, those are always cool. Anybody want fabric swatch books? Who wants to see them? Say me, me, me. Let me know. Oh, Kateri does. Mm -hmm. I say me. Let's see who else. Yeah. Yeah, I'll eat while I'm on here. I'll, I'll take a break and eat. Yep. Erin, are you going to have any more lace coming up? Um, 
No, no, not today. Not that I know of. A uh, Braille would like to see the swatch books. Okay. What is it? So a Brill and Kateri. Anybody else interested in these? Because if it's a Brill and Kateri, we can just do this. Oh, Katie is too. Okay. Katie wants to as well. Okay. He says, sure. Dartless is me. Patricia uh, is too. So I'll show this big thick one first, and then we will uh, we'll auction it off. Oh. Look, at, look at all that fabric, you guys. <laughs> I mean, holy smokes. <laughs> uh, I don't know. It says commercial residential textured solids. So can you guys see them? Yeah. Can I flip it this way. Yep. That's good. All right. Okay. And of course, they're going to be fuzzy, you know, from the other pieces sticking to it and stuff. They're not dirty. They're just fuzzy. So there's brown. This is blue and black. Brown. I mean, you guys get the idea. I'll just do a couple at a time, and then we'll start the auction. We'll just start it at a dollar. We'll see where it goes. There's a ton of fabric, lots of creams, a lot of creams. For you guys that like to do chubby chic and farmhouse and all that, a lot of creams and creams and tans, browns. I'll flip through it more slowly now that it's in. Okay, let's start with the reds. I just put me instead of go. <laughs> oh, you're funny. Oh my God, I need to get fired. <laughs> little Freudian. And then it's got the little paper on the end if you want to use those for tags. It's already papered for you, which is kind of neat. These are the reds and oranges. This is the kind of fabric my mother always had to have on her couches. <laughs> Uh, here's some browns, rusty browns. This has got all sorts of colors. Now we're getting to the creams and the tans. Katie, you got to go higher because the brill's got it at two already. Oh, it's not carpet. It's fabric. It's it's not. It's not. It's soft. It's soft fabric. And this is kind of like a wheat color. There you go, Katie. He's got it at three. Where's this one? This is a deal, you guys. I mean, holy smokes, you're gonna get like a yeah. hundred pieces. That's a lot of swatches. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Kelly. Maddie, you want to let it go a little bit? Okay. That's the two. That's fine. And do that. Fine. I'll give it another one. Into the creams again. No, it's not carpet. It's it's swatches. Yeah, it's, swatches. Yeah, it's fabric. Deal. Fabric. <laughs> Imagine how many different embellishments you can make from that, or pockets, A and ton. They're perfectly cut. And I can take it apart for you if you want. I can take the staples out before I send it if you guys want me to. A That's real a big deal. Five. Cool. And you still get those little end pieces to uh, make ephemera with, too. That's kind yeah. of. Yeah. Yep. Which is awesome. And I like the so fact get... that the fabrics are coordinated as well. Yeah, and they're nice. Oh, they're look nice at that. They look like linen to me. They're getting into some deep colors, which I love. Most of them, that's like a coffee color. Most of them look like linen, like a lot of them. And the light ones, you can actually go ahead. Okay, well, 30 seconds. The the light ones, you can actually go ahead and also, you know, spray or anything you want. Use some inks on them. There's blue. Oh, you could stamp on these. Yep. Peggy's got it at seven, so you guys got to go higher. There's blue, light blue, green. Okay, I'll get you some. 
And then it goes into the browns and the cocos. I like the ones that have the multicolored threads running through. I think those are so pretty. Stop. Okay. That would Dana for seven fifty. Who? Dana? Sorry, Peggy, you just missed it. Congrats. Okay. I have another one. Not as big as this one. No, I didn't go to Peggy. I went to Dana. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just letting Dana know. She said congrats, Peggy. Oh. Peggy's crying. Sorry, you're under the stop. Comes another one. Um, Dana, do you want me to disassemble that for you? Do you want me to pull the staples out of it? Oh, my gosh. Wait, 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 wait. I'm sorry. Oh. Sorry. My fault, guys. I will have top chat, not live chat. That did oh. go to Peggy for it. All right. So Congrats, sorry. Peggy. So sorry, Dana. Fitzmaurice. All right. Congrats, Peggy. Peggy. And that was eight. Yeah. I'm so sorry, guys. It's all right, Maddie. We're everybody here is cool. Sandra. Oh, good. A girl says she's coming in because I'm fired. Let me yeah. show you. Sandra, the only way you can fire Maddie is if you get your butt in here. Right? <laughs> yes. Thank you, Dana. Yes, it was my bad. I had it on top chat. I'm not sure why. I must have refreshed. <laughs> Sandra says I've done worse. <laughs> Okay, this is um, Country Classics. And we could start the auction on this for a dollar after I flip through a little bit. Okay. This is like a navy blue. This is a lighter blue, kind of like a ticking blue. Um, that's a sage green. These are so cute. All these colors together are adorable. Yellow. It's like a rusty brown, greenish brown. How cute would these stripes be all sewn together? There's the tan or the weedish wheat color. That's called rye. And then you get all these plaids. They coordinate with the stripes, obviously, you know. Same colors as the stripes, just in a plaid. Aaron said, Maddie, for some coffee. Yeah. I'm not cool. Get with the program. <laughs> yeah, you could start this, Maddie, whenever you want. Or did you already? Nope. Okay. And then here's some more of those linen -y. These are a little thinner. These aren't as thick as the other ones because this is a pull, you know. Um, drapery, Why drapery fabric. So. Patricia's got it at five. Cool. And you can let this one go an extra minute too. Let's give okay. people a chance. Please. Sure. Patricia's got it back at seven. These are like the linen -y stripes. And then she came back in. Okay. Here's some more plaid. It's a different kind of plaid, simpler. Yeah, Patricia's got mm -hmm. it at 10. Vicki, you have to go higher, hun. Santa's has nice swatches. They are pretty, aren't they? Very nice little size. And they have pinking all along the edge, which I love. Like and then here's the solid colors that coordinate. Oh, those are cool. Dana's got it at 11. Vicky comes in at 12. Yay, Darla, you got one. Isn't it awesome? Yes, indeed. This is white. These are linen. But they're not, they're linen print. They're not actual, you know, they're polyester, I think. Ish. It might be a blend. Oh, no, polyester. And then here's some more stripes. I think you got it at 15. Okay. 
All right. And there's the price price guide in the back. Now, is that like a clipboard? Is that what it's on? No, it's um, it's not a clipboard. What it is is there's staples through the top on the inside, big long staples. No chip. Oh, chipboard. Yeah, it's chipboard. That's cool. Yeah, it's like done, you can almost use that. Really thick. And the back is chipboard too. Nice. Thick. Thick chipboard. Don't throw away that backing, guys. Yep. And then you get a uh, plastic. Not that that's a big deal. It's pretty thick. No, it is because you can yeah. make um, shakers with that. Yeah, it's nice. It's and it's soft. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Vicky outbid herself from twelve to fifteen. So. <laughs> It's at 12. So it's at 12, unless nobody else. Oh, doggies. Sorry, guys. And there it is. There's a stop. It goes to Vicky. All first. right. Congrats, Vicky. All right. All right, here's another nice big fat one. <laughs> this one is textured solids, residential and commercial. And it's got every color of the rainbow. <laughs> All solids. It goes from turquoise to pink. So whenever you're ready, Maddie. Okay. Just throw it in and I'll just flip through. And like I said, this is just fuzz. You know, that'll come right off. It's fuzz from all the different. Do you want to add a minute to this one as well? Um, sure. Okay. There's turquoise, sage green. All right. Katiri's at two. Debbie's at four. Katie's at five. Grayish green. Grayish gray or greenish gray. Why do you want to send those stuff? Oh, I like that light gray. That's cool. Yeah, it's pretty. This is like a gold. This is metallic. This has every color in it. Yeah. Remember when you were a kid on your TV screen, if you put a water drop on it, it showed all the colors? Yes. That's what this reminds me of. Oh. <laughs> That's interesting. Debbie's a 10. This is like a light turquoise. Mm-hmm. Tan, it's like a royal between a royal and a navy. This is like a navy dark teal. Right, Debbie. She says fabric flips. Yes. <laughs> Dana says eleven. Navy and brown. There's some more of that metallic. There's some. This is called linen. This color. There's some more metallic. Wow. It's called viscose. <laughs> Whoa, Kathy, that's crazy. Oh, well, this is this actually has linen. This is 12% linen. And this is thicker. This is a lot thicker than that other one. And this has the frame around the edge. Coconut. Sorry, Maddie, I didn't mean to interrupt you. No, you're fine. Mm -hmm. Actually, I was going to ask you if, if Madison being too loud in the background, let me know. Oh, no, she's fine. Driftwood is that color. It's bark. Linen is that color. We're getting ready to be at the second wow, oh, guys, so pay attention. Wax. Here's another metallic. This is more gold. That one's called Dune. Here's another one. Semolina. Buff. Sable. There's another metallic. That one's called Blaze. That one has like a copper. This is like copper and gold. This one's called Coin. This is more of a like a penny. This is gold. Well, wow, that's a lot of fabric. You're still flipping. You realize yep. after three minutes. <laughs> so it's called Gold Dust. 
gold dust, sorry. This one's called corn silk. It's so thick they won't stay up. Stop, and that's sold to Debbie for 13, yes. Debbie Long for $13. And then look at all the colors on the end. Wild plum, smoky purple, Pompeii, crimson, pumpkin, macadamia, sun glow. Yeah, there's every color of the rainbow in this one. And that one goes to Debbie Long. Mm -hmm, for 13. For 13, thank you. Hi, Jean. Jean Moran's here. Hi, Jean. How you doing? Glad you could come hang out with us. And Maria's back for a little bit. Welcome back, Maria. <laughs> What time is it? Seven. Um, you are my last sale until Brooks next month. There you go, Debbie. So let's do. Oh no, Bima. Tampa. Tampa is beautiful. Not at all. Tampa is absolutely gorgeous and very safe. All right, let's do these. This is like. Let me see if I can get them all out. There's like a buffet scarf, which is like a yard long. And there are the napkins that go. Hold on, I gotta dig them out. Um, I'm not really sure which ones go with them. I have a couple different packs in here, so give me a second. Okay, let me see. Okay. I'm going to say these. So you get one, and these all have lace all around, and they're big. And they're nice. Um, I think these have been starched. So you get one, two, three, four, five. What do you want me to name this one, Erin? Six. Um, buffet scarf napkin lot, seven, eight. And you can auction that one off. And then after this one, I'm going to call it a night, ladies. And I'll put my email in. It's up. Oops. Oops. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. You got it at two. Kathy's coming in at five. And I didn't see a stain or a blemish on any of these. I think, I don't think they were ever used and you have enough for eight people. And they've been, um, they look like they've been starched and ironed. I did not wash them. And they do not smell. They smell like, um, like laundry to me. <laughs> I don't know, Bima. Maybe me. If there's anyone here, she's not subscribed. Possibly I don't know. I know you're subscribed to me. <laughs> Let me go check and see if I'm subscribed to you. Let's see. No, I was not. I am now. We're coming close in the 30 seconds, guys. Watch the chat. And I try to mail everything media mail, guys. Um, obviously, whoever won the, the treasure box with the uh, with the poodles, I will not mail that media mail because you will get the poodles broken. But anything that isn't like fragile. How many? Eight. There's eight napkins and a yard long, really nice, uh, either dresser scarf or buffet scarf. And there's does not appear to be 
a blemish on any of it. It's all in like pristine condition. And there's a stop. That is sold to Kathy for five. All right, thank you, Kathy. And thank you everyone for a wonderful sale. And for everyone that ordered from me on my little tiny sale that I had the other night, I will include all of that in your, in your box. And I'll get you the best price I can, shipping wise. And you know me, I'm kind of slow, so give me at least a couple days to get everything together. Because my problem is I don't have I don't have the right boxes and I have a hard time finding boxes. Sometimes I have to make my own boxes. <laughs> so bear with me. And if I, uh, oh yes, Tess would like me to remind you to recycle your boxes, please. Recy reduce, reuse, recycle. Well, the most important one is to reduce. Crafters are the craft, you know, the most recycled people in the world. We're so recycle friendly. We recycle everything. Yep, I know. <laughs> it's great. So yes, thank you everyone for coming. Thank Maddie for helping us. My pleasure. Okay. And um, I think I'm going to do this every Wednesday. Every Wednesday night, I think at five. If you guys want to come on and and it won't always be, you know, a sale. Some night it'll some nights it'll just be crafting and hanging out. So yeah. I'm glad you all came. Thank you, everyone. I appreciate it so much. Make sure you say Aaron, Aaron, lease mine to the next sale of yours. If that oh, you want me to hold it until the next sale, Vicky? I can do that. Let me make a note. I gotta write it down or I won't remember. Cause that's how I am. I don't even know what I do with my pen. <laughs> my pen rolled off the table. Tess, will you throw me a pen, please, dear? Oh, glad you popped in too, Maria. Amelia, you want me to hold yours too? I can do that. Okay, so hold Amelia's. Oh, you're welcome, Patricia. Thank you. Hold Amelia's and hold. Vicky Sparkles. Okay. Old Vicky Sparkles. Okay. I can hold those until next week. That is not a problem. Yep. No problem. Yes, I'd love it if you come back. Even if you just come to hang out and chat and have fun, that's that's awesome. Mm -hmm. Okay. Tess has dinner on the table, so. Good night. Um, on hugs. Blessings. Hugs. Yes. I just have to get to the other window. Uh-oh. <laughs> Where is it? What did I do? What did I do? Oh, shoot. How do I? Oh, it's at the bottom. See, I still don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> All right, there it is. Okay.